Hello guys, this is Wilbur Power Independent Care. Today I have a new tripod that I'm gonna show you right now. This is the tripod that I that I just bought from the Thai store, Shopee, which is from UCSD. The model number is q 3 9 You know what's so special about this tripod is the uh, it has center column that can go horizontal. It's gonna be a lot of advantage when you shoot the top table shot or overhead shot or something like that. Okay, I'm gonna show you right now. All right, you see the leg? This one is the twist lock style where you can grab it all at once and it twitches like this and pull it out like this. Yeah, it's all gonna be set, all right? Let me do this on all side of this tripod. Yeah, it's easy it's like this. A kid can do that. <laughs> I can do that, okay? Here's the example that I try to show you. Okay, okay, that should be done. Use an up right here, which is lock center column. You can unlock it and just the high, the highest one that we can get is around 165 centimeter, which is my high. If you want a higher tripod, you can go for another module. Let's see the next part. It's ball head. I'm gonna remove the ball head for you. This ball head is removable so if you got to change it to the head that you need you can do that it's use the uh, 3 8 inch screw i think a lot of ball head will support that okay this is the ball head that come with this tripod qscd it's like ball head where you can loosen the knob and tighten it they have three knobs these two knobs for the, for judging the ball i don't know why they have two knobs maybe it's for security purpose sort of that yeah you, there you have two knobs okay we can adjust it you want to lock it you go tighten the two up here then it lock it's good it cannot move all right and uh, the last knob on the bottom is function for the uh, panning let me put this back on okay a little too high I judge it so you guys can see. Oh, it's, it's tight. Okay. All right. A lot better, right? This is the lock knob where you can lock or loosen it for panning shot to adjust a little more for the accuracy. Okay, there you go. What about the plate? Plate is just simple. It's not the uh, quick release plate, but it's work very well. You just have a, a knob where you can tighten it just to lock the plate that attached to the camera. All right. And they have the level, you got the bubble. The next part is gonna be the center column that could go horizontal. You can just touch it because it has something to lock it down here, which I'm gonna show you. This one is lock the center column to this tripod. If you wanna remove the center column, you're gonna have to remove this one first. Let me demonstrate for you. I'm gonna remove it. Okay, now it's off. So like a screw. Now we can remove the center column. See that? Okay. See the hole right here? This is you put the center column in to make it horizontal to here. Uh, okay. When you put this, you can look like this. And there you go. You can lock it. You don't even need this anymore because it's going horizontal. You, you might want to keep it very good because if you if you want to shoot for vertical, you're gonna need it to lock the your center column. Or maybe you don't need it. It's your choice. Huh? This is what it looked like. Okay, I wish I could show you more, but I don't have any camera left because I only have one camera, which is I use to film it right now. I hope you like what you see and give me a feedback. Lastly, if you're interested in this product, I'm gonna put a link down below. You can go and check out that link. I'm just a person who uses product and like it, wanted to share it with you guys. It'd be helpful if you subscribe me, or oh, it's okay if you don't want to. <laughs> okay, thank you for staying to the end and see you next time. Bye.